William Hill, the home of betting. Well, my jumper to follow for this season will be the John Joe O'Neill trained Taquin de Sul. Now, obviously, it was a little bit of a below par performance, to say the least, at Newton Abbott recently, but I'm not worried about that. I think the horse will come on a bundle for that run. He was a grade one winner at Cheltenham at the end of last season. I'm really hoping he makes up as a Gold Cup candidate, of which I've backed him for accordingly. His jumping is getting better and better with each run. He's due for a crack at three miles in the Charlie Hall chase. I think he's a horse of immense potential. So Tarquin de Sul is my jumper to follow. My horse to follow for the jump season ahead is Apache Stronghold from the Noel Mead Stable. A really good novice hurdler last season. Injury curtailed his season a little bit, but he was second of all to her at the Punchdown Festival, and his school and his report have gone really well according to Noel Mead. So I think Apache Stronghold could rank really highly in the novice chasers in Ireland this season. I think he could be a grade one horse. Let's hope he is. A better round of jumper would have seen Byways win the uh, novice handicap at the Shelton Festival last season, and he's definitely a jumper to follow. He could run in the Hennessy or the Paddy Power Gold Cup and the ability he showed to beat two decent flat horses in a two mile hurdle at Ludlow suggests he's got loads of class. He may even develop into a Gold Cup contender in time. My jumper to follow this season is Jossie's Hill. He achieved an excellent level of form over hurdles. He was second in the Supreme Novices and won a grade one at Aintree. But the way he hurdled, particularly at Cheltenham, was, was inefficient. Um, he did very well to finish as close as he did at Cheltenham and I think he's going to be much better as a chaser, as is often the case with Nicky Henderson's runners in the Supreme Novices. Jumper to follow them for the season, some pressure on me because I put up for Heen last time out. Could we possibly repeat the dose? Well, it's another Willie Mullins horse for you here, an unexposed one, this and the Rich Ritchie colours come over from France, but it was a top bumper horse. Alès Colombier, really high hopes for this one, could be going to the Royal Bond and group ones like that before ending up at Cheltenham. That's his name, Alès Colombier. My jump source to follow is Very Wood, trained by Noel Mead. Now, he won at the Cheltenham Festival last season. That was over hurdles, but I've always thought he's going to make into a better chaser. He's likely to contest one of the top novice chasers in Ireland around the Christmas time, probably the Dream Mortal Knight Frank novice chase, before a big tilt at the RSA chase, which is a race that Jiggins Town have won before, Weapons Amnesty in 2010. I think they could hatch a similar plan.